motherfucking fam, as y'all can see on the thumbnail, we got the King Daytona car review today. Before we get started, man, I hope everybody's having a great day. Thank you for all the support. Thank you for all y'all subscribing, commenting, liking the video. Y'all continue to do that for me. I appreciate it, every single one. And as, as I mentioned before, I love the interaction. So make sure y'all go in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think. Comment anything down below. You know I'm going to comment back. I'll reply back to every single one. Uh, but today, as I mentioned, we're going to do the King Daytona. Y'all can see right behind me. We also got the Black Ghost. I'll give you a quick one review on that Black Ghost. But we got the King Daytona here. And y'all can see we're inside the garage right now. The only reason is that is because it's too hot, man. It's too hot in Texas. It's over 100 degrees, but we're trying to bring y'all the hottest content as best as we can. But let's go ahead and get started. Y'all can see this bright orange, very bright orange Hellcat. Let's go ahead and get started so y'all can see right off the bat, this is a red eye. This is a red eye. Y'all can see the red eye on there. And then you got the 20-inch rims right here with the SRT brakes. Those are the Bam Brembo brakes. And then you also have the hood pins right here, easy to access when you just pull this away. Boop, 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 easy. There you go. And then you pull it back, push it back, boom. You have your hood pins there. You also have the badging right there. Great looking car right here. It does bring a lot of attention, but that's what it's about. A lot of these Hellcats, brings out a lot of the attention when you're driving. Just the horsepower and everything that comes with it. There you also have the wide body frame, as y'all can see right here. You got the wide body frame. And then you also have the King Daytona, as it says right here. You got the King Daytona badging there. Pretty cool little, this is a nice car right here to have. You have the spoiler back here. Let's go ahead and Pop the hood, let's pop the hood here. See what we, we working with. Have the Hellcat engine right there. You got the red eye, this thing is smoking hot. This thing is loaded. You don't even have to do anything on this car. Maybe you can add a few things, maybe some lights, but I don't think you need to add anything here. Let's go ahead and transition on the interior. All right, what y'all think about this interior? You got the black, Seats. It got leather and you also have the Alcatara combination. You have the Daytona on there. I think they should have put King Daytona or maybe put a, a King Day, King right here and then Daytona. Maybe like a little crown or something. And then you got the orange stitch in there too. You got the middle console. And then you have your cup holders right there. Big screen. You got the King Daytona right there. That's what I said. I think they should have put the King on these seats. It makes you feel like the King. And obviously, it just looked the same as the other Hellcats when it comes to the, the dash. You got the orange stitching here. Y'all can see right here. You got the orange stitching, orange and white. And then you got the carbon fiber here. This, is, this thing is fully loaded. Got the orange stitching there too. When you come to the door, same thing. You got the orange stitching, Alcatara, leather. leather. Uh, so it got a lot of convenience there for you. Let's go to the passenger side and see what it feels like to be a passenger in one of these beasts. When you come around here on the passenger side, also it's roomy. Roomy, spacious, same thing. You got a lot of space. You got the, the speakers right there. Yeah, this is definitely a nice little car. It got the sunroof up there. So you got the sunroof, suede sunroof. So this thing is all black inside. So you got the black suede, black everything. You can't see nothing else, but just black. And then when you come back here, it's also spacious. This is a full-size sedan. So what you can see, you have a lot of space being in the back seat. So if you have any kids, definitely have room. And then you have the USB port. You got the AC right there. You also have this middle console where you can lay it down if you need to put a cup. Definitely got the sensors on the mirrors there. 
Let's see what the trunk. Check this out. You got you got a lot of space on this trunk. Got a lot of space, very spacious. It does come with the the locks also. Quick, I want to show y'all what the black ghost look like real quick. So you got the black ghost, same thing. You got the 20 inch rims there. Now, if you think about it, a lot of Hellcats has their logo right here. But since this is a black ghost challenger, they actually put the challenger there. And that's how you know this is a black ghost is you have that challenger there but it doesn't have a Hellcat logo. The Hellcat logo is gonna be right here, right over here. So you got the Hellcat logo right there, the black badge, and then you have the hood pin similar to the King Daytona. Look at this hood scoops. This is the Black Ghost. There it goes, this is the Black Ghost. Y'all can see this one is 100K for right, this is for, this is 100K for red eye, wide body, challenger, as y'all can see right here, special edition, black ghost. This thing is a beast. Gets all the bells and whistles. And then this one definitely all black. Got the carbon fiber on there. Got the carbon fiber. You got all black interior, all black exterior. Uh, they should have made this black too, but I mean, I ain't, I'm not Dodge, but that should have been all black. They were kind enough to let us review one of these vehicles before they get shipped out. They actually going out of state. We're in Texas, so this one's going out of state. Now I want to give y'all a quick rundown of what they look like. All right, at this time, and I appreciate y'all staying in with me. And if y'all like these vehicles, man, y'all comment down below. Let me know what y'all think about the King Daytona. The Black Ghost. If y'all are interested of getting one of these vehicles, um, you can also reach out to James. James, it works here at Uptown Dodge. Make sure you reach out to him. He'll help you out, get you the best deal, best car you're looking for. Y'all can see we got them back there. And and I thank y'all for y'all's support, man. I appreciate all the time y'all have put in on this channel with me. And hope y'all have a great the rest of your day. Stay warm, Stay cool. Stay cool, take care of your family, keep your family healthy, stay safe, and at this time, Texas Rugged, I'm out.